case, but I, I've just been checked because my Nana had it. It's genetic or whatever. It's made of brass, but sacks is a woodwind. Yeah, it's not the same, like, mouthpiece, I guess. I could play anything with a reed. Pretty much, if you learned how to play clarinet, you can play anything with a reed because clarinet is a devil's instrument. Um, but if it doesn't have a reed, like, it's not a reed instrument, I don't know what the first thing. Like, trumpet shit? I oh, couldn't do it. I don't know what to do. I could probably figure it out, but I, it wouldn't sound good. <laughs> yep, Nog, you're right. It was literally one of the first treat, um, treatments for glaucoma. It has to do with how it makes vibrations, not the material it's made of. No shit? Oh, weird. Holy shit, time factor, what? Holy ball sacks. I'm so sorry. You get yourself some weed. Cheers. Thank you for that reason. I hear the new content in Battlestar or in Battlestar? What? In um uh, uh Galactic is amazing. If you want to play it sometime soon. <coughs> <coughs> I can buzz my lips. <laughs> See how good I am? Mini dicks! What are you doing here? I could ask you oh, DRG, yes. Thing. I heard there's the new well, content really good. Here, and that means one thing. Let's try Ooh, cars. the pills might be better if you don't smoke anything. That way you're not like just starting to smoke and you're gonna be coughing and shit. Um, but you've heard me talk about edibles versus smoking, so you know the differences. <coughs> Alchemy! Lover, how are you doing? Okay, uh, how'd you manage to get out of Two Town? Let me answer that question with a question. Who could possibly dwell on the past when we've got cards in the present? He's a liar. So, Big liar. It's trade, I love we? you guys. <laughs> I love my mods. I love how they terrorize each other. Yo, I don't know if you guys noticed, but we're a big supporter of Alchemy. She's an amazing streamer. Recently, very recently partnered. Like, within the last month. She plays a lot of Final Fantasy, and when we hug, she fits right here. She's a little Polly Pocket person. <coughs> we all like banging alchemy. I'm coming down from some major anxiety. Saw someone in the visitor's center of my base. Oh, I'm so glad you saw someone. Good. <coughs> <coughs> Let me look at these cards, Lord. An old cannon from the no dice. Um, how much? I have two thirty five. Okay. Blink dodge. Slow down. A generous life elixir. Oh, so generous. I'm gonna just get that and call it good. I wanted both anyways. <gasps> Poor Alk. Alk is actually not allowed to go in the mod closet because it's just straight up not a safe environment for her. She's too pretty. It's kind of like you know putting sweet food out on the counter in the summer, like, you know you're gonna get ants. Oh, don't shoot that person. Fascinating. Fast greetings. I'm doing a survey for the Upper Class Gazette. Do you have a moment? Oh. Yeah, I think you'd be there by default. It would be like an accident. Like, we'd be like, Fiat has to be here, blink. And you'd be like, half making a sandwich in your kitchen, you know, cleaver in hand, like, Everyone's naked. What? It would be like that. Calling the other mods ugly or... No, not at all. They just all have this psychotic affinity for... Alk. It's not like any other food is bad, but ants like sugar. You know? You can put, like, fucking whatever else you eat. I don't eat very often. I can't even think of a food on the table. But if you put some sugar out, they're all gonna go for the fucking sugar. 
know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, this is the thing now. Sick. <laughs> Dude, we should make all the mods of food. Ice penis. Which food? Ice penis is a chef. What food would you be? You could pick your own. I don't even know. You know more foods than me. Yeah. Oh, he does make some fine ass looking sushi. This is true. He quit the job to save his flesh, but he did make perfect looking sushi. These are facts. A ding dong. Stephen Hart, I love ding dongs. Uh, how did you know? Norvin Bega, welcome to my channel, welcome to my stream, my name is Classic Katie, it's fucked up, let's meet you, take my brother with your church, from my fucked up family, welcome to the classiest place on earth, I invite you and brother, take your pants off, place your hand in my channels, and enjoy your time here on stream, be on the floor, invite you to the same, brace your goddamn nudity, mouth lover, every hole is gold. <gasps> she still got it. <laughs> um, do you have a moment? Whatever. Splendid, splendid. I have only one question. Who do you think started this war, turning our lord, their father's castle, into a battlefield? Surely you know the story of the three siblings. <gasps> Foot. Okay, but I love eating pears. So, and all fruits. I think I'd be a fruit for sure. I'd be like like a fruit that looks really cool, but once you buy it and open it up, I'd be like a dragon fruit. Like really exciting and odd looking, but once you eat it, you're like, there is nothing going on here, is there? Just like mealy water, you throw the other half away. <laughs> I know, Viata, he makes some fine looking sushi. Um, Surely you know the story of the three siblings. Of course, the three siblings, yes, definitely. Who do you think did it? Who do you think killed their father and started this bloody civil war? It was you! Uh, oh. The paranoid count, the fancy duke, the tough as heck baroness, all of them. All of them. Well, that's the sort of opinion that'll make nobody like you. My word, my word, what an opinion indeed. Thanks, guys. I have my moments. <laughs> Oh, did Greetings. he just tell me to I'm fuck doing off? A survey for the upper it was your mom, possessed. Ruth! Do you have In a the moment? library with a wrench. Splendid! Do you splendid. not remember me from two I seconds have ago? Only one question. Who do you think started this war, turning our lord, their father's castle, into a battlefield? Of course! Who do you think did it? Shit. Who do you think Shit. killed their father? I want to. I, I do want to hear the story. I just thought it'd be different Greetings. responses. But it's I'm not. doing a survey for Shut the up. upper class gazette. Splendid, splendid. I have only one. Oh, Here what we go. fun! Yes, let's. So, since Cheers, you're bitches. hearing this for the first time, uh, let me tell you about the three siblings involved. Please do. There's Cheers. the paranoid count up in High Bet Haven to the west. The soft and coddled duke living in Fogwash Garden to the north, and the duty-bound and tough-as-heck baroness living out east on Wildcard Hill. Who do you think did it? Who do you think killed their <coughs> father and started this bloody civil war? None of them. Why would any of them benefit from a civil war? None of them? None of them? Oh, I've, I, I've never heard such an opinion before. It's bold. It's direct. It's quite possibly insane. I'll write it down right here in my <laughs> survey. Ah, oh. Me crazy. I've got half a mind to... to... Uh, what was I talking about? I don't know. I'm no you need a face wash, honeybean. Heck. Most of us here are. Okay, so I would be a perfect rare to medium. Wait, 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 excuse me. Rare to me medium rare. Prime ribeye, sliced, covered in hot garlic. Sorry, my Find mouth is getting them. juicy. Let none who the and king. rosemary butter with a sprinkle Let of Maldon sea salt. So, seriously, um, I was going to say you'd be a ribeye, well, but I didn't want to insult you by saying just a ribeye because I knew you'd say all of that. But I agree. Because when I think of you, all I think of is your fucking sick ass knife skills and some fucking perfectly sliced piece of meat. Me 
don't have great sushi here in Colorado either. But the trade is we do have fantastic uh, Mexican food. So, you know. Excuse me, have you seen any kids? Why'd you ask, stranger? What's your motivation in all of this? Uh... He's a friend in trouble, and I'm worried. Oh, how heartbreaking for you. How tragic, you poor child. Oh, I love pomelos. Ugh. First people think, oh, this is just some abnormally huge lime fruit, and then once they tear you open, they'd be like, what is this eldritch horror? But they're so good. Okay, I'm gonna take pomelo. That's way more fun. I'm also extremely pale and round. <laughs> I love pomelos. I like them specifically because they taste like a grapefruit, but you can peel them with your hands because they've got that like fucking like inch of horror. <laughs> <coughs> so have you seen so many, seen any kids running around? Oh, heavens no. That sort of thing wouldn't interest me at all. Good grief. Spying on people. Oh my god, she's oh, I on make sticks. A point of not remembering Look at those anyone I see in public. Tim Burton legs. Privacy is very important to me, you understand. Bless what your heart, honey bean. Counts demanding full reports of everything everyone does every day and all. Oh. So, you won't remember me if, say, Nanny Fortuna asks. I promise it, stranger. Oh. What kind of food is Finnish food? Like, what would you say is like characteristic, characteristically Finnish? I've never been to Finland. According to Ancestry.com, though, I got a little Finnish in me, if you know what I mean. Ayo. It's a butt plug from Finland. It's fine. What's this? Nothing. Sick. Dude. I, those make me uncomfortable. Oh, I don't know what it is. Is this what it's like to be short all the time? <laughs> nope. Hate it. Yes. I never let anyone finish in me. Protect the king. He's in danger. We have to. Shut the fuck up. You don't remember? It's creepy. The attack has begun! The king must be saved! <laughs> David never apologized. I love it. Which king? I thought he was killed. What? It's a bird living on their stranger. hair. I'm Ethan. What's your name? I am Nishka. And I'm, I'm, I, I, I used to protect somebody important. Peg arm. I think. A ruler, maybe? Before the war. Hmm. What were things like before the war? Oh, even you sweet child. You can't keep clinging to the past. The king's dead and gone now for you. years. Don't you remember? What kind of hair gel maintains that? branch i wonder amazing right wait i don't what how did you know my name <laughs> i like them you told it to me you said it was a lucky guess a lucky guess about what what were you guessing? <laughs> the king protect the king from danger oh <laughs> oh boy, I can't wait to get oh. back home. Uh, but I can't get back home without knowing the way. Or can I? Hmm. Oh, <laughs> hey mister, uh, do you know the way to one... Uh, oh, wow, uh, you want a hug? Or, uh, okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Wow, it's, it's pretty cold in here and dark too. What? <laughs> the fuck? Uh. I want that. 
money. Oh, <laughs> stranger danger. That's an understatement. <laughs> Did that person be... Yep, candy? We don't eat candy in the game, right? I haven't eaten candy, right? Not yet. <laughs> Music grows in intensity. She's nervous. But on the surface, she looks calm and ready. To drop a bomb. But she keeps on forgetting. Not to wipe now. The poo stains are gone for now. She's on her knees. Help her, she needs a shout. Oh my god, who is this? Hello. Oh. That looks like a two person. Get the van. <laughs> Excuse Um, have you seen my friend Bernard? A boy in a sixer uniform. Alive? Oh, I thought I saw one running around here recently. Are Alive? Boxy clothing. That's a reaction. Check your Halloween candy for main characters. There's pet actors out there. Oh my god. Did any kids actually get edibles in their candy this year, or was that just a big stupid thing they put out again? I wonder. I didn't get one trick or treater. That's Bernie. Did you see where he went? Can't say I did, unfortunately. But you'd better find him quick before the Shadow Man does. Shadow Man sounds great. Who is this Shadow Man? Can you tell me about the Shadow Man? <laughs> Everyone knows about the Shadow Man, child. Especially children out all alone. Nog, I said the same fucking thing. Nobody is going to give out their drugs. Drugs are expensive. I literally said the same thing. Thank you for re uh, assuring that I'm but correct. You better find him quick before the Shadow Man does. That's not fucking scary at all. Why don't we kill Shadow Man? That sounds like a better plan, dude. Why are you letting Shadow Man roam streets? He sounds like a bad dude. What? Oh, yay. Yeah, I've actually seen people set their hair, David, with um, like a glue stick. Never Elmer's glue, like not the runny stuff, but I've seen a glue stick be used. A glue stick be used? I've seen a glue stick used. English is hard sometimes. You look sad. Excuse me, have you seen a small child? Kids never run around here unsupervised. Yes. That's yep, what the same nog. When I was a kid, it was razor blades or like, they would say they'd put like a, like a roofing tack in a candy bar or something. Never. But my mom would go through all our candy, like open all of it. But I don't think there was ever a confirmed case. I think people just get paranoid because someone says something on the internet or something. I don't even know. Like, where were they saying it back then? There was no internet. I'm for us commoners. Have you seen a boy, yay high, in a sexy uniform? All I know is that if a kid's missing, the shadow man's probably got him. My mom always let us trick or treat though. She always came with us, but we never did like a parking lot or anything. Although I hear they do good par like trunk or treats. They make them pretty fucking epic these days. Everyone seems to fear him. As well they should. You should be afraid. Child. Dude, Rod, amen. Like if I'm not going to give you a king size candy bar, you bet your ass I'm not handing you any of my drugs. You need the mind killer to control the drugs, control the people. Fear. That was like the best part of that whole movie, sadly. In my opinion. Excuse me, have you seen any kids? Have you seen my friend Bernard? Hmm? Leave me alone, I'm busy. Zusa, always and forever. Always and forever. With slows. <laughs> um. I'm busy too, I'm trying to save a child. Well, good luck with that stranger. If there's a kid running around unattended, the Shadow Man probably has him by now. The Shadow Man? What do you mean by has them? Oh, you really are an over your head. Yep. Um. You think the Shadow Man took the nods? If it was anyone, it was him. That's just who he is. <gasps> None of us can change I our nature. actually passed out That's what during I it, David. If you stay a spell, all Marjorie and Took can tell you about him. I wasn't a huge fan. I actually think I like the 80s one better. Yeah, it was pretty. It was pretty. It was pretty. 
Those people are absolutely out of their minds if they think I'd waste even one piece of edible on their kid, dude. I, I don't think anyone would do that. Like, And rich people wouldn't do it because they won't even fix a water problem that is cheap to fix for a rich person, let alone buy drugs for kids. Like, fucking Bezos closed his house down on Halloween. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was a pretty one, but David, I agree. It wasn't like, oh my god. Um, I thought uh, the main character was played kind of lamely and boringly. I thought most of the characters were just super boring. They, there wasn't much going on, and it made Jason Momoa's character stick out like a sore thumb. Like, he felt like he was not part of the cast, because everyone was so sullen and... Uh. I don't know. Just me, though. It was okay. <coughs> Pretty. The Shadow Man. He was born in the time oh, of the David, first I mean, And he lives on to this day, but not like you or I. He lives in the walls. The walls of Mulgro Alley. And he can always see you, but you can only see him when it's dark. Snuff out the lights in Mulgo Alley, and you'll find him there, Ew. waiting. But be warned, but he's child. He's gonna take me. It may be the last candy. thing you see. So he's a ghost. If he were merely a ghost, we wouldn't be having this conversation. Oh. Goodbye. I do not think we will see each other again. She's a toque. Yep, I think the second one's gonna be a lot more entertaining. Simply exactly what you said, Erica. Like, it's gonna, if, if, if they go according to the books, it's all the action and stuff. So it should be more entertaining. But yeah, the first one, it just felt very character buildy. Like, they were trying to build characters, but the characters were like vanilla you soup. Want to know about like the melted shadow ice cream. Man. Yes, I do. You want to know about the Shadow Man? Yes, I would. <laughs> The Shadow Man comes when night Five pennies? Day. What the dick? He'll come and take your child away. And you might cry, and you might pray. But the Shadow Man comes when night eats day. Why even answer the door? Um... <coughs> <coughs> I am a machine of phlegm. Oh god. The controller unplugged itself. Um My wife finally got the courage to try and smoke weed again. Last one she was I remember you told me she had a horrible experience. Yeah. Now she's been off that med for several months and she wanted to try oh, did she, oh, she's finally able to enjoy it. Oh my fucking god. That's what I want. I sped read that because that's really what I was hoping to get to, but I'm so happy. That makes me have much joy in my heart for her. Really disappointed with how they portrayed Lady Jessica. Yes. Oh my god. She was a courtesan. A powerful fucking witch courtesan. Like, bitch, you don't survive that lifestyle without having some kick-ass moves. You know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. It's like marriage changed her or whatever. Or she's not even married. She just, like, only fucks him now or something. You would hold your back out and then would pull out like a roll of pennies and just count off five. Give them the roll, the fuck? What? That is bizarre. Like, at least give us the shitty, like, Tootsie. Tootsie you know the, the bundle candy? Get like Tootsie Rolls and Blow Pops and not Blow Pops, you know, Dum Dums and Sweet Tarts. What else do they put in there? Laffy Taffy, maybe? Jolly Ranchers? Like, that's better. What? No, it's cool. I get through most things. I'll say it if I can't read it. <laughs> but I'm I'm okay. I'm okay. Um, tell me more. He don't like the dollar store bag. Yep. And he don't like sun. He'll come out the wall when the daylight's done. Come out of walls. Snuff out Muddy Grow Alley's lights. <gasps> then you best run for the last night of the Shadow Man has Hold begun. Up. I'm afraid of the dark. I think I've told you guys that before. Sounds to me like you're fixing to go see him. I wouldn't thank me just yet. <laughs> oh. So behind me somewhere, something was looking at me and there was candy in front of it. <gasps> it's children.
I don't want to go. <laughs> Dude, what the tit farts? I swear to God, something was watching us over here. But I can't do anything to that. Okay. Why are you so scary? You want to know about the Shadow Man? That's okay. You'll know him soon enough. Oh. <laughs> okay. Snuff out the lights in Mulgar Alley, and you'll find him there, waiting. Is this Mulgar Alley? Streetlight terminal, nothing else? What does that mean? I can't snuff that one out. Is this Mulgar Alley? No. I'm just gonna shoot lights till one goes out, I guess. <laughs> Man, I'm a puss. Is that blood? Is that shit? Is there blood and shit? And... <sighs> they did a really good job making this creepy as fuck. <gasps> Miller, what up, motherfucker? How are you? suddenly felt like she was being watched. I'm playing a spooky game. You can't just do that. I did too. What are you looking for? What? Is it part of a... Is it part of a series? Okay, so we've got some... we got two nice shelves. They're all bundled nice. There's two here. I'm gonna go through that one. And then those. That's it. Just one side. It's like a big old bug. I'm gonna crawl under my desk real quick. Get up and pee your pants. I'm gonna help him find one of the comics because I reorganize the books all the time. It's only fair. 